So, I got an issue here. Uh, my favorite college basketball team, aka the Purdue Boilermakers, just had the worst fucking game basically since World War II. They scored 37 points in a game Sunday, which was apparently the worst since like 1947. Um, they shot 25% from the field, which is the worst ever by a Purdue men's basketball team. And um, I've had it. You know, I'm I'm call. I, I've said this for you know, kind of on the DL for a few years, but uh, I'm saying it out loud now. Purdue needs to get rid of fucking Matt Painter. The dude's a fucking bum. Matt Painter is shit. Okay. Example. The dude's never made it past the motherfucking Sweet 16 in the fucking NCAA tournament. Okay? Never made it past the Sweet 16. Even that one year they, where he had Chris Kramer, who was like a fucking, uh, I think he made like the all-defense team or whatever the fuck college does. I don't really follow college basketball that, that heavily. But that year, I followed it real heavy. And they had Chris Kramer, who was an all-star defensive player. They had Etwan Moore, Robbie Hummel, and, and Juwan Jameson. Those are the four guys that I remember on that starting lineup. Three of those guys got drafted into the NBA. Etwan Moore still plays in the NBA. I'm not sure about Juwan Jameson or Juwan Johnson. I may have to check up on it. I'm not quite sure, but I know for a fucking fact Etwan Moore plays in the NBA. Robbie Hummel got drafted into the NBA until he started getting all these injuries. So, Matt Painter had three fucking NBA caliber players on his team. And he can't make it past the motherfucking Sweet 16. That is unheard of. You have national title teams with one, maybe two NBA players on them. Maybe one, two, probably three. But like you have three players on your team. You can't even make it to the Elite Eight. You are garbage, Matt Painter. And if I was Purdue, I would have fired him his ass a long time ago. Because his recruiting style is all about getting those big men. He just wants to get the big man, and he wants to dominate the paint, which is fine. I guess. But has, you, has it won you any fucking games of importance? No. Then why do you keep doing it? I don't understand it. I really don't. You can have like maybe one good defensive uh, anchor in the paint, but you don't need to make that your entire recruiting strategy because obviously it ain't working. Obviously, you need people who can shoot the ball, move the ball, and fucking score points very quickly. That's, that's not big men. You want big men in the NBA. You don't want big men in college. Because college is such a different game. It is so fast-paced, and it is so, like, grueling on the big man. Because when a team is shooting 25% from the field, the big man ain't going to help you. And he is not going to be able to help you with that. Anyway, I'm done ranting. Uh, I'm going to go. i got to get some groceries. Uh, and uh, hopefully some ramen. I don't know. We'll, we'll see what happens. Fuck. Fire Matt Painter. God damn it.